Okay guys, uh, Sergeant M here, and I said uh, earlier that I would uh, try to make a video as far as like how I do, how I do uh, fine lines and uh, dots and stuff. Uh, what I have is a center pneumatic uh, airbrush, uh, a little cheapo from Harbor Freight. Uh, it's affordable, but it works, it's great, it does really fine line stuff. Uh, um, you can do larger areas with it and you can get real fine. And then what I was uh, saying before was uh, Primo gave me a little tip as far as how to get really, really fine lines and that's to get real tight on your project. Uh, and always remember, you know, of course, first, air first and last. Um, and this is really all about trigger control. I got some Createx mixed up in here, just some black reduced down with the homemade reducer formula that you'll find on here. And uh, we're just going to spray. And again, uh, air first and last. Um, spray at about 35 psi. So uh, here we go. Uh, again, here's a kind of a wider line. I'll have to apologize in advance if the compressor kicks on. Uh, but some wider lines. And then we got, we can do some dots here. Really fine. I'm not even sure how good that's going to show up on the camera because I can't see the back side of it right now. So I hope you can see that. That's why I'm using black. This, I'm just using a uh, manila folder. That's all it is. You can see the holes here on the side where it goes into a binder. Um, but there's some dots. Some really fine dots. And I don't know if you can tell, but my trigger figure is barely moving. So we're going to do some fine lines here. So here we go. And if you can tell, my, my tip is almost to the edge, almost right on top of the paper, uh, the folder. Uh, you do want to be careful with that because you can easily... Alright, so as I started to say before the uh, compressor kicked on, um, I cut this, so it spared you guys the noise. Uh, as I started to say, you can easily get some spiring, and you can see that right there. So you do want to be careful uh, as far as you know, going too fast or too slow. Uh, too fast, and it's not going to be defined enough. Too slow, you're going to get that. So there we go. Uh, Central pneumatic airbrush, 20 bucks at Harbor Freight. Doing really fine lines. And again, this is just uh, normal Createx. Uh, we got a siphon feed brush. Normal Createx, the homemade reducer formula, or since it's water based, just use water. Um, and I hope that helps you guys out. Uh, got any other questions? Of course, post them up. I'm sure somebody else will come along, but this is a trick I learned from Primo, and I have to give him the credit for it. I certainly did not come up with it. A uh, little dagger stroke. Again, as you're, going, as you're getting, as you want to go finer up top, you want to get closer. Um, you, you want to bring your brush in closer. As you come out, it's going to get wider. And of course, trigger control is a big deal. I don't know if you could tell how much my trigger finger is moving or how little it's moving I should say. I'm not even moving it that much. Okay so again uh, cut this while the compressor was running but I'm not using I'm not moving my trigger finger that much if, if you can tell. I'm not trying to pull this thing all the way back and get full full paint flow. It's not what you're doing here. You just little tiny bit of movement here. Air first and last. Um, you guys might have saw my mouse mod uh, just a little bit ago. The blue, the blue and black one uh, with the streaks and stuff on it. Uh, this one here. I'll show you how I did the dots. It's kind of 
you might have done it already just practicing kind of messing up but what you do spray a little bit cut off the air you notice I kept the trigger back cut off the air let the trigger go forward and next next thing you do spray it you see that little spot right there see I'll show you again spray cut it off <clears throat> So I got those little specks on the mouse. So in case you were wondering how I did that, that's it. I'm sure you could do like a star scene with that. You know, you're trying to do a bunch of stars or something. Um, make something look old. Um, what else? Um, if you're into gory stuff, uh, blood splatter. And I have one of my kids coming in. Daddy, <laughs> Yeah, so sorry we got interrupted there, but anyway, um, I hope that uh, this video helped you out. I uh, hope you learned something, and if you have questions, post them up. Um, you guys have a good night. I'm out.